What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Demons here and today I am back with another Icon completed SBC and we have got Michael Ballack, the German and Chelsea legend. He's played for other teams as well but being a huge Chelsea fan, I'm a huge fan of this guy. I mean, if you look at his stats all around the board, there's greens everywhere, not a single red stat. He's absolutely insane with the medium attack work rates, uh, high defensive work rates. He's going to fit perfectly into my squad. Uh, I do have all the completed challenges as I did with the Rui Costa SBC. Obviously on this one, I've done the iconic SBC to add a pack onto the last video, which didn't go great in terms of rewards but the team of the year is still out this is getting recorded not long after that so it's quite late in the day it's thursday it is 10 58 p.m i believe yes it is so it's 10 58 p.m it's quite late so i can't be overly loud obviously with my reactions but i don't expect to get anything huge like a team of the year or an icon so just a walkout a couple of walkouts would be great as i stock the packs up i'm completing all these squads or I've already completed the squads. Uh, this is the 86 rated squad. Who am I missing here? Uh, I think that's going to be a Raul or that informed Raul. I think there's quite a few players. I think there's a couple of Raul's I've got on the transfer market that I need to pop in and a Raul Jimenez as well. There's the two Raul's that I've bought. I've pre-bought these. Obviously selling the Vertonghen and Iniesta. Now if you look at my coin total, I am very low. So I need a few big players in these packs. You know, something, if I can get back three to 500k from these packs i will be absolutely ecstatic with that because then i have a foundation to build on for the next upgrade on my players i don't know who i'm going to get next what i'm going to do with my future team because balak's going to slot in for isco he's going to go on the uh, bench he'll probably come on at some points so or he'll just go in a fitness squad as we go into the 87 rated squad now again i think this needs a rally yeah, it does he needs to go right back i believe or is that haradeki I'm not sure. He, I, I believe that's the Raul. Is that Haradeke? I'll quickly check. Let me just go to the transfers. See which one's actually... Yeah, I used him last time. What am I doing? Start price. Why am I comparing price? What am I doing? So, go back. Send to club. Yeah, there we go. So, I'll send him to club. Pretty sure he needs to get put into that squad to complete the 87 rated squad. And then I have got the 88 rated squad after that. Not interested in, in, in any of the other icons. I was tempted if I make quite a bit of money to try the Shevchenko, obviously being an ex-Chelsea player. But I think I'm going to go for someone like Marcel Desai next or maybe a Prime Claude Makalele would be pretty good. As you can see that I put my vote in Team of the Year voting for Hazard for the 12th man. But I think Salah probably deserves it. By now he would have come out and it will probably be Neymar. Like, I think it's going to be Neymar because everyone's like, oh, Neymar is going to be like 97, 98 rated. He's going to be a huge card. But I think 2018, getting the Premier League record for most goals in a season, I think it should really go to Salah. But it's not going to, I think. I think it'll probably go to Neymar or Pogba because all the Man U fans will be like, oh, Pogba's good. But let's be honest. he's. He, I mean, he's played a bit better now under Solskjaer, but... I still don't think he's one of the best players in the Premier League. I think the best player in the Premier League on his day is Eden Hazard. And then after that, you've got the likes of De Bruyne. I think Aguero is still one of the best strikers in the world when he's on form. I think he's better than Kane, although Kane's undoubtedly good. Uh, Got to put Hideki back in the squad here. He goes right back. Who do I need to buy? Um, ah, it's Kadira. It is Kadira. Do I need to go out and buy Kadir? Yeah, it is Kadir. I've got it up on my PC, sorry. That's why I'm looking at the PC while I'm doing this because I've got this squad up because I knew I had to go and buy someone. So I'll quickly change Vidal's positioning. Oh, Isco. Yeah, Isco. So that'll give me that extra one chem that I need. So I've put Isco there. Now I just need to go and buy Kadir, but I can't be bothered to go to the transfer list. I'm just going to lazy buy him on the transfer market, see if I can. So it looks like he's going for around 8 to 9k. So if I can find one for like 9,000 coins by now, I'll buy him now. 9.4k, I'll take that. Ah, uh, obviously he's going to expire. 9.5k, I'll take that. Yes. So I'll take that one. Take the 9.5k for Sammy Kadira. Chuck him in the squad. There we go. Easy. So I need to try and make at least 250k back from all these packs. So I've got quite a few. There are some pretty decent packs. But first things first, let's have a look at this Prime Balak. I mean... 
I am over the moon with this. I've been buzzing to do this card for a while and he's only got four days left as he walks out. What's he going to do? Is he going to come out, do a Superman sort of celebration? What, what celebration is he going to do? That is just walking out, calm as you like, pumping his chest. I am the German, Michael Balak. Happy with this. He's going to go straight into my squad. He's going to take one of them centre mid roles. Probably the right centre mid. Drop Kante CDM as he is. Uh, Kovacic will stay on the left centre mid. And Lamps will go Cam. As this go drops to the bench. Because I don't feel it will be as good in that left centre mid role as Kovacic. So I'll put him onto the bench. And people know it will just go. So it's a tough decision to make. But he's still got a good card. Anyway, let's start with these packs. As we go into the primo, premium sorry, jumbo gold pack. It's not going to be a walkout. Is it going to be a board? It's going to be a board, but I'll skip anyway because otherwise this video is going to be far too long. It could be like 11, 12 minutes long. I want to keep it around the 10 minute mark. So the best player there is Dimitri Payet. Uh, hopefully I'll be doing a bunch of the premium Premier League and La Liga SPC upgrade packs with all the gold players that I get from all these packs, from the Rui Costa and the Balak packs because... I could get an untradeable blue card and that would be really good. As we get William Carvalho, that's not bad, 84 rated. I'm pretty sure I've pumped him into one of the squads that I've done over the past two videos for one of these prime icons. I didn't even play a game with Costa as you saw, I just popped him straight back into this SBC. It's really the last pack that, I think it's the last one at the end. We've got a couple of rare mega packs and then we've got that ultimate pack, 125k. 30 players, all gold, all rare. That's our best chance of getting something good but... I mean, getting a team of the year is still like less than 1% because I'm doing this before they bring out that 12th man, whoever it's going to be tomorrow. But I just wanted to get it done. I want to get a player early selling because their prices are dropping. So quite a few of the players like Varane, he's only like 1.5 million. Uh, Van Dijk is like 1.3, 1.4 million. De Gea is not expensive. Marcelo is not expensive. Kante and Ramos are around the 2 million mark. Uh, I haven't checked Modric, haven't checked De Bruyne, but Messi, Ronaldo, and Mbappe are all pretty decent. Mbappe is like four mil, Messi is around five mil, Ronaldo is around seven, eight mil, I think. So imagine getting a team of the year, Messi or Ronaldo. I mean, if I get a Messi, I'm keeping him. If I get a Ronaldo, I'm selling him. I think the only players that I will keep are most likely going to be. I mean, I've just packed an untradeable Kante. 89 rated, so I wouldn't ever want to put in him into an SPC because that's a 300 plus K player. At, at the moment or 200 plus K depends on how much he's gone down because of this team of the year but he's the sort of player that I would sell to upgrade my team I think the only player I'd probably keep actually is Messi because I've got an untradeable Mbappe got an untradeable Kante got an untradeable De Gea got an untradeable Varane uh, Ramos yeah he could drop in my team he wouldn't be too bad but that would mean getting rid of Dave Aspelacueta which I don't necessarily want to do because I'm a huge fan of his in real life. And that's what I play ultimate team for. It's my ultimate team. It, I don't want to have a team like everyone else. You know, with Courtois in goal and all this. As we go into the first of the two big packs. It's a 100k pack. Come on. Why is it not even a walkout? It's a joke. It's a 100k pack. You get 24 players. All gold. All rare. At least it's going to be... Uh, no, I thought that was going <laughs> to... It's an 83 Lucas Vasquez. I thought that was going to be Marco Asensio. At least it's an 85 rated. But it's not. It's a joke. 83 rated Lucas Vasquez, 83 rated Tar, a couple of 82s, I think. That's absolute garbage. You may go for something that I'll chuck him up for sale because of that Ica Casillas SBC, which I will be doing. I will be doing that Ica Casillas SBC in a future video with some other packs, probably, because just completing that SBC is enough. But we'll see what comes out tomorrow at 6 pm as we're going to the big pack. Come on, walk out, walk out, please. Yes, it's a walk out. Come on, be a special card. Be something good. Oh my god, it's a blue! It's a blue card. Come on, who's it going to be? French. Can Kante. It's N'Golo Kante. Yes. 96 rated N'Golo Kante. Look at him. N'Golo Kante. Na, 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 na. N'Golo Kante. Na, 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 na. I do not know any of the words from the French team when they sang the song because they won the World Cup. Da, 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 da. Da, na, na. N'Golo Kante. We're looking at 2.2 million. There's one there with a 2.1 million bid on it. Wow, that's insane. We get an 85 rated Falcao as well and an 84 Gundogan, but I'm really not bothered about that. I'm just going to pull him straight up for sale because I think by Monday when all these players are out of packs, he'll go down below the 2 million mark potentially as people start 
getting ready for team of the season and all these players have been packed so i'll stick them up at two million i'm guaranteed to get that so that's def that's basically giving me my balak for free and the rui costa for free so that's an amazing end to the video that's my best player of the year so far i can't see me getting any better for the rest of this fifa to be honest anyway guys if that doesn't deserve a like i don't know what does so please drop a like if you haven't already subscribe that'll that'll help out a lot i'm close to 1000 subscribers i'm over halfway now as i'll quickly show you the team where i'm going to pop balak in there he is right center mid taking isco's spot i was thinking of going five at the back to put him and kante in midfield but i'm not going to do that don't know why it's still got the concept one in so i'll quickly put the actual one in here nine to one rated so as you can tell i'm trying something different with a mic hopefully it's not as fuzzy and my pronunciation isn't as bad but yeah drop a comment down below i'm absolutely ecstatic with that and i will catch everyone in the next video peace